making the highway safer for drivers. A new guardrail is coming to a portion of Interstate 581, and it's the first of its kind in our region. 10 News reporter Allison Wickline broke this story earlier today and is live near Valley View Mall with a look at why the barrier is needed. Allison. Yes, we've covered several serious crashes along 581, and that's why you may have noticed strips of dirt or gravel in the median. Those are actually called stone mow strips, and they are the first step in a safer trip for travelers. At first glance, high tension barriers like these on I-77 in West Virginia may not look like they could stop an out of control car or big rig, but VDOT says they are some of the safest technology in the industry. The state of the art guardrail will soon be installed along a portion of Interstate 581 in Roanoke between Liberty Road and Peters Creek Road. This is really about improving safety and reducing the severity and frequency of cross median type crashes. The project has a big price tag, $900,000, but VDOT says it's a small price to pay to make the highway a little safer. This particular location does have a, a history of cross median type crashes. And yes, there is a lot of history here. 26 cross median crashes have happened on that stretch between November of 2012 and December of 2017. In comparison to traditional guardrail, this type of high tension cable guardrail actually stops vehicles better. High tension cable guardrail can only be used in relatively flat areas. That's why it is only being installed on a portion of 581. It is also less expensive and easier to maintain than regular guardrails. VDOT expects the guardrails to be completed by late spring. Live in Roanoke, Allison Wickline, 10 News, working for you. This is a story we broke on air at noon. We also sent out a push alert through our 10 News mobile app around 1230. Make sure to download the app on your phone to get all the latest news updates.